Hi everybody, Chief here again. Time to read another story. This one is called, Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus. It's written by Mo Willems. This looks like the pigeon. Hi, I'm the bus driver. Listen, I've got to leave for a little while, so can you watch things for me until I get back? Thanks, oh, and remember, don't let the pigeon drive the bus. Okay. There goes the bus driver. The book is for Cheryl. There's our pigeon. I thought he'd never leave. Hey, can I drive the bus? Please. I'll be careful. I tell you what, I'll just steer. My cousin Herb drives a bus almost every day. I'm not sure I believe that. Oh, true story. Hmm. Vroom, vroom, vroomy, vroom, vroom. Pigeon at the wheel. Have you ever seen a pigeon drive a bus? I don't think I have. No? I never get to do anything. Pigeon is sad. I've never driven a bus either. Hey, I've got an idea. Let's play drive the bus. I'll go first. Come on, just once around the block. You think he's gonna be able to drive the bus? I'll be your best friend. How about give me five, I'll give you five bucks. No fair. I bet your mom would let me. What's the big deal? It's just a bus. I have dreams, you know. Fine. He's trying to everything to drive the bus. Let me drive the bus! Wow. Wow, he's really getting excited. Oh, he looks sad. No one's letting him drive the bus. I'm back. You didn't let the pigeon drive the bus, did you? Great. Thanks a lot. Uh, uh. Bye. The pigeon is sad. Hey. What do you think this is? A big red semi-truck. Maybe the pigeon can drive the truck. And that is don't let the pigeon or kid drive the bus. Okay, till next time. Bye-bye now.